Have you ever wondered why we call blood types A, B, A, B, and O instead of just A, B, C, and D? It's not just a random choice. The story behind these names is fascinating and reveals a lot about our history and science. In the early 1900s, a scientist named Carl Landsteiner discovered that not all blood is the same. He identified different blood groups based on the presence of specific antigens. But why A, B, A, B, and O? The letters represent the antigens found on the surface of red blood cells. A and B are named for the antigens they carry, while AB has both, and O means none. It's a simple yet brilliant system that helps us understand compatibility for blood transfusions. But here's the kicker. The letters C and D were already taken in the scientific community for other classifications. So, AB, AB, and O became the standard. Next time you hear someone talk about blood types, remember it's more than just letters. It's a story of discovery, science, and the importance of understanding our bodies. What's your blood type? Share in the comments and let's see how many of us are A, B, AB, or O. And don't forget to share this video to spread the knowledge.